Hey, welcome to this video. You arrived here. You're probably searching for a view of receipt char. Uh, so go over how it works. I'll give you my two cents whether I think it's a good use of your time. And if you like my free training on the number one simplest, fastest way to earn a full-time income from home working part-time hours, you can click the link below. You'll see my email opt-in page. Enter your best email. I can send you my free training if you want. Receipt char, let's dive in. So what it is, basically it's an app to allow you to upload receipts um, from stores that you're already shopping at. Uh, you'd earn points for your efforts and you could, once you accumulate enough points, you could redeem them for uh, PayPal or gift cards. Um, if, if, if you live in US or Canada, if you live in Australia, then it's gift cards only. And the app is available for both iOS or an Android. You can see Apple Store, Google Play Store. Um, it has a very good reputation in the industry. You know, 4.7 stars on Apple Store, 4.6 on the Google Play Store. And um, and you might be wondering, why would Receipt Chart pay you for uploading receipts, right? It seems pretty simple. Well, if you go to the How We Use Data page, um, they explain it all. So um, essentially, they help third-party corporations in their market research. Uh, for example, you know, these third-party corporations might want to know, uh, are people between 18 and 25 who live in San Francisco, say, are they more likely to shop at Safeway or Whole Foods? Or what are the demographics of the people who shop at my store? Not my store, but the corporation stores. Uh, they want to know these things, and these companies will use that information to help them uh, improve, you know, their products and services and how they market. Um, and, and just save money. And receipt char is kind of the middleman in this exchange. And so they're able to pass on some of their earnings to you for, for uploading your receipts. And um, now you won't need to share any of your personal data if that's what you're concerned about. They only, they so they aggregate data and they only care about um, the, the, the anonymous stuff. So not, not your phone number, not your credit card. It's more like, you know, where are you shopping and your basic where you live and demographic information, that sort of thing. So as far as how the app works, it's pretty straightforward. Uh, they've broken it down into three steps, you can see. Uh, so once you've installed the app, step one is upload uh, receipts from over 11,000 stores. You snap a photo of your receipt using your phone and uh, make sure it shows the retailer's name, the, the purchased items and prices, the purchase time and total amount spent and upload within seven days of the receipt date. That's very important, otherwise it won't count. And they accept everything from, um, you know, everything from, you know, uh, all sorts of retailers, health, pharmacies, uh, toy stores, petrol stations, restaurants, uh, cafes, clothing, home furnishings, office supplies, you get the idea. They don't accept um, hotel fees, hair salons, electric bills, phone bills, train bus tickets, and taxi or rideshare receipts, but they accept a lot more than they reject. So, so I'm sure you could find something on here that you know rep represents where you shop. And um, now step two. Oh, I should also mention um, they also have uh, an option where you can shop it uh, online, and you would just upload a digital receipt as opposed to a physical. So, but it's mostly for physical receipts. And then step two is earn. Now, how many points would you earn? Well, it's the same page I was just at. So, and this is all in their help section, by the way, very useful. Uh, so below $10 on your receipt, you'll earn five points between 11 and $50, 10 points between 51 and $100, 15 points and over $100, uh, 20 points. So they're very transparent. Um, and they're, they're also, it's not, it's not mentioned on this page, but once you reach 120 points for the week, all receipts submitted during that same week will only give you five points. So no matter how uh, much it's worth um, in dollar terms. So, so 120 points is the maximum and then five points after that for the week. And then, but then it resets each week. Um, and if you're not active for 30 days, then you would lose all your points. So you want to be pretty active relatively active on here and um, now there are other ways you can earn as well and they, they mentioned here sharing the app uh, with friends you'd earn 200 points it, once if someone uses your referral code to sign up and they, they have to upload their first receipt and they would also earn 200 points for using um, so you'd both earn 200 points so that way it incentivizes them to use your referral link and then you also earn a bit and then 
and there's a shake game. So this is interesting. This is where the more active you are on here, the more shakes you could get. And that's where a shake is just where you would shake your phone. It'll randomly generate some numbers and if you and you could potentially win a prize, uh, which is uh, the prizes are just uh, more points basically. So, um, but you might not win anything. So it is kind of like luck, um, but it is nice. And also not listed on here are monthly prize draws where you're automatically entered into these prize draws each month every time you upload a receipt. You don't have to do anything. Um, and and the prizes are, you might have guessed it, again, more points. So, um, and then, and then the, the and then you'd redeem your points for uh, gift cards and you could see lots of different uh, gift card options. So uh, Airbnb, Adidas, Amazon, Banana Republic. I'm sure you could find something of interest on here or PayPal if you live in uh, the United States or Canada. And you can see a lot of these gift cards, um, they start five to $10. So you didn't need to accumulate that amount. Um, and that's kind of how this app works in a nutshell. So it's a perfectly good app. There's, you're really not doing much work, um, but you're also not earning that much. I mean, a thousand points is equivalent to um, about five dollars. So it's gonna, and it's gonna take you a while to rack up a thousand points. So let's say you're shopping three times a week at over a hundred uh, and spending over a hundred dollars each time. So, which is actually a lot of shopping, I think. Um, so that's 60 points. That's going to take you about four months to accumulate $5 if you're quite an active shopper. So this is by no means a life-changing amount of money. It's not going to allow you to replace your job, retire, or anything like that. Um, it's simply a way to earn a teensy tiny bit of extra money for something you're already doing, shopping. Um, and, you know, you could sign up to multiple of these uh, receipt and cashback shopping apps. Ibotta is big one. Receipt Hog, Shop Kick, there's many of them. I would just sign up to all of them. There's no rule saying you can't do that. Um, one cool thing I like about Receipt Jar is not so much the earning, it's earning potential. It's They have an expense tracker that allow you to kind of stay organized and track how much you're spending on groceries. It'll give you like um, a graph showing if you spent more in one week than usual. So that's kind of a nice budgeting way to budget. So that I might just use it for that purpose. And then any money you earn would just be, you know, gravy. And that's kind of it. So I hope you enjoyed this review. But look, maybe you're here not necessarily because you want to earn a little extra money here and there. Maybe you want to earn real money. Maybe working from home. I'm talking $20, $50, $100 an hour plus. If that's the case, what I suggest is click the link below. You'll see my email opt-in page. And earn your best email. I could send you my free training that'll detail a business model. You could do 100% from home. You don't need any special skills or credentials to get started. The startup costs are very low. The profit margins are very high. Um, and there's lots of leverage and automation in place, meaning you don't have to be there all the time necessarily. And you can earn commissions in the background 365 days a year on autopilot once you've set everything up and you've done the work. So do the work once and it continues to pay you for years to come. And that's it. So I hope you enjoyed this review. Hope to see you on the other side and I hope you have a great day. Bye.